Hi, it's Eric from Home Network Central, and I'm going to show you how to change your Wi-Fi password from your Android smartphone. The first thing you want to do is connect to Wi-Fi that you're going to be changing the password for. So you, on the upper part of your screen, you can put your finger on the upper edge of your screen and drag down, and it brings this menu. So you'll see the left icon on mine that says Saturday, May 2nd, and right after, right below that, there's a Wi-Fi icon that's blue on the very left side. So if you don't see your Wi-Fi icon there, you can drag this menu down again and it'll bring more icons and you can swipe it left or right to give you, show you all these options. So you're looking for the one that says Wi-Fi. Mine's in the, mine is in the upper left hand corner and you wanna turn it blue. So yours might be gray or you know, a dark color. Blue means it's on. So when Wi-Fi is on, if it's not on, you tap it to turn it blue to turn it on. And now I want to get to my Wi-Fi settings. So I'm going to tap and hold the Wi-Fi icon and it'll bring up this list of networks that you can join. And you might already be on yours, but for, my, for mine, I'm going to connect to my Wi-Fi network by clicking on Netgear 10-5G. And you have to have your password to log into Wi-Fi in order to change your password. So that's this is your Wi-Fi password, that your current Wi-Fi password that you have to type in here. Now, so for some people, for some of you, this might seem kind of counterintuitive. How can I change my password if I don't know my Wi-Fi password? Well, if you don't know it, then you have to reset your router to factory settings so that you can use the default password to log in. If you don't know how to do that, you can search on YouTube for uh, how to reset router to factory settings. I actually have a video on that if you want to check out my channel, Home Network Central. So my password for my router is Vanilla Trumpet. Vanilla Trumpet 461. So now I'm going to, that's the password that came with my router from the factory. When I, when I reset it to factory default settings, that's the password that is given to me. So you, then you hit connect. So once you connect to Wi-Fi, it says checking the quality of your internet connection. And of course, I'm not gonna have internet. I'm gonna stay connected. I hit stay connected. So now I'm on my Wi-Fi router. So you can go ahead and go back to your home screen like I just did by clicking on that home screen button at the bottom. And now, if I wanna log into my router, all I have to do is swipe the screen down again, then hold the Wi-Fi icon, and then you'll see the network I'm currently connected to is Netgear 10-5G. And to the right of it, there's a little gear. You click on that gear. Now in this menu, there's an option that says manage router about halfway down. You just click on that. This is the easiest way that you can do this on your Android phone. Click on manage router and then it's gonna open up your browser. I'm gonna use Firefox. So now it's asking you for your username and password for your to log into your admin interface of your router. Uh, for me, the default, the default username is admin and I happen to know my password is admin. Again, if you don't know your router uh, login information, you're gonna to have to reset it to default settings to default factory settings, and you're gonna have to log in with the default info. That's the only way you're gonna be able to change your Wi-Fi password is if you can log into this router. So you hit okay, and now you logged in. On this Netgear router, on the left side, I'm gonna zoom in here, and you go to wireless, and then it brings up this screen. So you'll see I have two different networks. There's the 2.4 gigahertz network and there's the five gigahertz network down below. The two places where you change your Wi-Fi password are right there and right here. So just to make sure that's clear, one is right there and one is right there. That's where you change, there's two separate passwords, one for your 2.4 gigahertz, that's the one up top and then this is where you change your password for your five gigahertz network. And then once you change it, there is an apply button up top. So you go ahead and click apply, you, hit, you click that green button and that will be how 
you change your password. So I'm going to change mine to Vanilla Trumpet 4612. And I'm also going to change this one to 4612. And I'm going to hit this big green button. I'm going to hit apply. And your router is probably going to reset. This network one, this Netgear router is resetting. So that's how this one works. So I'm expecting that I'm gonna I'm gonna get kicked off my Wi-Fi because the password's now wrong because I just changed it. So it's probably gonna make me log in with the new password. Once this is done resetting, it's probably gonna get an error or something like that. It looks connection timed out. Okay, so that means I'm not able to connect to the router anymore because now I have to update my password. So you drag this menu down, you hold your Wi-Fi icon again. It says incorrect password. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on it. It says connecting. So, okay, so now it's asking me for my new password. I changed it to vanilla trumpet. Four six one two. So you can hit that little eyeball to the right of the password. You can click that and it'll show you what the password is. So you can click connect. Connected without internet as I expected for my router because I'm not connected to the internet. And now I can go back to Firefox and it'll probably ask me to log in again. Well, I remember that I was logged in. So now I'm back logged in back to the router. So if that helped you, give me a like. I got more videos. You can subscribe and get more help like this. Uh, if you got any questions, let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching.